Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm just going to show you how to make a hop link in Clickbank. Now I'm just going to scroll up a bit. So I'm already signed into Clickbank, okay? And um, what I did is I signed in and I went to Marketplace, so I pressed on there and then I went to search and I'm just going to search for something to do with WordPress because that's what I'm into and it came up with some results but they were pretty crappy so I went down here and I said search results by gravity okay I chose that and it actually um, searched again and it came up with the most popular uh, best selling things first okay so there's a plugin um, a WordPress theme uh, membership site uh, Chris Farrell um, social bookmarking automa uh, automation software blah 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 people love automation so yeah um, stuff like that okay so the next thing I did um, is that I wanted to get my hop link for here. Now getting a hop link doesn't mean that you're going to get a picture so we'll get the hop link first so I'm going to press on promote oh sorry the window is already open so I'll just have to find it there it is there because I already had it now you put your Clickbank ID in okay um, and you can put something else in here like um, I just put WWB for WordPress website builder now that's the website that it's going to be for and then I'm going to press, press create okay so as you can see we've got two links here now this is just the plain link that you can insert and use okay um, and this one here as you can see it will say click here okay um, that's what the title text will be click here now I'm just going to take this because I usually just make the links by myself so we're going to copy this okay so select it and make it blue and copy it okay and I'm gonna go and paste it onto a notepad and I've got one open here now this is what I've done here I pasted that link that I got here it is here there it is there I pasted it there now these are what I'm gonna do is I want to find a 728 by 90 banner for this product so what I'm going to do is go back to Clickbank okay we'll close that because I've got the link right we're back at Clickbank now here it is here this is the thing now I've already pressed on promote so now I'm going to go and press on this here okay and the website opens up wait a minute we'll start right we're opening up the website that we're actually going to promote now this is where people are going to be sent okay now it looks quite good um, I like ones that promote with a video that's great now what I usually do here is I go right down the bottom of the page keep going right down the bottom and it's got usually not always has an affiliate link here so we'll press on it now I've already um, signed in there and this is I went on to the next page um, I'll just go back one I'll show you where I landed I landed here on home but as you can see I'm in the affiliate section now it's giving me tools so I can promote their stuff and that actual hop link that I got before is going to help me so what I'm going to do is go to the banners section and it says uh, click here to see the banners so here we go we're at the banners page now just say I wanted this one here okay right here I'm gonna take this 
Now as you can see it's got a generic link in there. See that? You have to replace that part with your hop link. Now that's what most um, people do. They um, show you the banner, um, they just put that generic thing in there and all you have to do is put your hop link in. So I'm going to copy that code and I'm going to take it to the notepad where I pasted that link. Okay. Now here we are. I've got my hop link here. Okay, all here, this long hop link. And I'm just going to paste the actual code that I just got for that banner. Now there it is there. Now it's not ready yet because I need to put my own details in here. Okay? I do not want to put the banner up and have that there because I won't get any um, credit for it. So what I'm going to do is copy my hop link, right, right click on it, copy it, and I'm going to paste it in here. Paste. Okay, there we go. Right, so that's ready to go. Okay, so what I'm going to do is just copy one. I'm just going to show you. Copy it and I'm going to go and take it and put it into my website. Okay, so we've got to I've got it open here somewhere. I've just got to find the right tab. Now, this is the back of my website and yes, I'm using Socrates and um it's fantastic, of course, and if I sh I will do a tutorial on the inside of it. It's amazing. Um but what I'm going to do is go down I'm on the settings page here for Socrates and it just it's so easy to put things in here now what I've done is I've gone and collected a banner from cj.com and another banner from um, Clickbank and then I'm just going to paste this other one in here now you're going to have to put it into your website any way that you do um, Socrates just makes it easy for me to do so I'm gonna um, press save that's how easy I do it okay now I'm gonna go to my website and I'm just actually in the middle of fixing it up so it might look a bit weird at the moment I'm just gonna press on the home page right okay so what I did is I put three banners in there so there's one of them so let's say we just oh here we go it's rolling over to the next one there's one of the banners that I got from Clickbank and it'll it should roll over to another one in a second I'm not sure whether it does or not they're actually advertising the same thing so we might not notice but the banner that I just got okay that one's not rolling over so what we'll do is we'll just go to another page say let's go just press on another page and go there there it is oh it just rolled it just came when um, we left but anyway as you can see um, that's how you get um, a banner up there but um, if you don't have this Socrates theme um, ooh, it is a little bit difficult sometimes to put a banner in like that you're gonna have to go into the actual code so for example if um, I'll just show you where the code is we'll go back inside my website I'll show you where the code is but because I have Socrates I don't have to use that um, we're going to go to appearance we're going to click on appearance and then we're going to go to editor now if you've got a smaller banner you could easily fit like a 250 by 250 square into your widgets which is easy enough to do um, but if you wanted a 728 by 90 banner I would probably you'd have to go um, 
to the main index um, template basically and put it in there somewhere or um, if you had space in your header um, and stuff like that maybe you could put it in your footer sometimes it depends what kind of um, design you've got now with the um, widget just say I went and instead of getting that 728 by 90 banner just say I got a small one well what I would do is I'm in the um, widgets here as you can see and I drag some text over a text box and that's what you put your code into so I'd paste it in here the code that I got but obviously I'm not going to use this because it's too it's too long it's not going to fit but if you wanted to put a banner in there um, that's as easy as that so there is your Clickbank advertising done right there alright thanks for watching um, I hope that helps some people with the Clickbank link link okay see you later